Welcome everybody, Marcus Stone here. In this video, I want to show you how we can set up audio and video settings in Discord. So let's start. First, what you want to do is click here on the settings down below. When you are here, you will get here app settings. Click on it. And first you will see the voice and video settings. So let's start with the voice. So now you get input device and you're going to set up microphone. You need to be connected to your computer. Then you get output device. And right now I have this one here and I can choose uh, between my speakers, for example. Now you get input volume and then you have mic test here, mic test. So right now, okay, I can hear myself. Yeah, it's, it's kind of different when I can hear myself, by the way. So then you got output volume. It's quite simple and quite understandable. And then you have input mode. You can choose between voice activity and push to talk. So when you get a voice activity, it will be automatically. So right now, when it go above this white button, they can hear me. But if I'm going to increase it, no one can hear me right now if I will be speaking in a voice chat. So just keep it small. This is really uh, good for games like Counter-Strike Global Offensive, Rainbow Six Siege, uh, in which it takes you a uh, time to press a button and speak. So that's what I think. I really think it's useful to go with the voice activity if you don't want to struggle with uh, speaking to your comms. And, but then you have option to push to talk. And right now, when you can choose the shortcut, so I don't know, like one or whatever on, or, or your keyboard or mouse four. So right now, when I would click mouse four on my mouse, uh, it'll be push to talk. And that's quite easy. The last thing what you got is video settings. And first you are going to choose camera. Right now I have only one. So what you can do is also test video and you should be able to see me, but I don't think so that you will be able to. So wait a second, I need to delete this. I will close this one and let's start it again. And let's go with the settings. Yeah, video won't work because it's right now connected to my Streamlabs OBS, but you would see a cam here. So yeah, and this is how we got video settings. Also, you got video codec here, voice processing. I really recommend the echo cancellation. That's really good. And also noise suppression. I have it also for my Streamless, so my voice is a little bit better. And just enable quality of service high packet priority. That's good. I didn't. Uh, I don't lower the volume of other applications. It's like, let's say that you want to play a game uh, while being on Discord, and like uh, the Discord will lower the volume of your game. It's like not good. <laughs> okay, this is like set it up. Voice diagnostics, show warning when Discord is not detecting audio from your mic. Set it up, yeah. And latest technology to capture a screen, yeah. Use an expert method to capture audio from games. You don't need to do that. I don't have it and I just have it on default and I'm fine with it and it's really useful and effective. So this is how we do it and it's quite easy, I think. So yeah, thank you very much everybody for watching. If you enjoyed this video, you can support and subscribe. You know how it goes. And thank you. Have a great day and see ya. Goodbye.